Hey, 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 what's going on? Welcome to my channel, T Girl Magic Tarot. Here to do a reading for <clears throat> my Jig Jig Gemini. My Gemini's. What is going on, Gemini? What is happening? Thank you guys for joining me. Welcome. New subscribers, cross watchers, everyone here is loved and welcome. Thank you guys for everything you do for the channel. I'm sending you an abundance of love, light, um, healing vibes, a hundred million trillion fold to you, Gemini. Yes, I am. All right, choir, come to the front. <clears throat> One, two, three, oh, T girl, T girl, magic and collective. T girl, T girl, T girl, magic and collective. T girl. Tarot, magic and collective. Come check us out and see what we're about. Uh, we are Gemini, 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 Gemini. We sing Gemini, 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 Gemini. We are Gemini, 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 Gemini. Gemini, Gemini, Gemini. Yes. Yay! Give the choir a round of applause. Hallelujah. Now keep in mind this is a general message. It's not going to resonate with each and every person. So only take what resonates and leave the rest. Okay? If you want a personal reading, you can contact me in the detail, the description box below, and the details in the description box below. My like, well, I can't even talk. Anyway, Gemini, Holy Spirit, ancestors, Holy Spirit, ascended masters of the highest white pure love only. What is going on in Gemini's energy? Okay. Beside, ooh, damn, a king of wands is pissed because you done closed out a cycle on the bitch. Yes, and they are heartbroken, Gemini. Leo, Sagittarius, or an Aries, yes, they want to come back and reconcile. They want to say, I'm sorry. This person is hooked. They addicted to you. Yes. But they could be a sex addict with the... And they are their monies could be they could be, they spend too much money or they could have be a sex addict or it could be all the above okay what's going on spirit with this king of wands that's mad at gemini for closing out a cycle with them what's going on with them spirit what's going on oh they want they mad they want to start a fight spirit what is they don't want they don't want this shit to be over they want to reconcile the Sagittarius, Leo, or Aries energy. They are angry and they are spying on you, Gemini. Yes, you are. Yes, they are. Yep, they want to make an offer towards you. What's up, Gemini? Look, you don't see it coming. You don't even see it coming. They try to make up with their mind if they want to message you or not. So expect some type of quick, uh, quick communication, email, something. Now, they might message you, child. What is the hell is this? They might message you. For some of them, they don't want the cycle to end, and they want to come out of the cold from your energy. Others of you, they may message you that they are literally homeless, okay? And they don't have much money, and things have stopped for them, and they're moving slow. They probably just got arrested or something like that. I don't know. They might have went to jail. For some of them and they need something to help them get back on their feet so now all of a sudden they come into you gemini hell no okay what else holy spirit Whew. seven of cups gemini you're cutting out people that keeping you in illusions and sis but this person they're gonna try to be blind like they're gonna try to play you a little bit like they did try to play you okay they did try to play you and they're going to act like they didn't try to play you. They may blame that maybe this person left you out in the cold. And they're going to blame it on maybe them going to jail abruptly. You know what I mean? Trying to cause some type of illusion in their communication. So you can be like, oh, that's why I haven't heard from you. Is because you went to jail. Yeah, this person is in regret for whatever they did. I don't know. They might have went to jail. Then they may not have been to jail. For some of you, they did. And most of you, they did not. With why they are telling you is they're trying to get your sympathy because they've destroyed this relationship. This person is in a depression. They're in regret and remorse because they have, you see the water under the bridge. They want, they, they because they fucked up, even though they ain't no fire, they ain't burning the bridge. I feel they, they, they fucked up their bridges. They, they, they can't cross, okay, that bridge anymore with you, Gemini. 
because what they invested in, they receiving judgment right now because they were being manipulative. Okay, they been, they were fucking they they were being manipulative towards the magician, towards the Gemini. It could be another Gemini. It could be any sign, but whoever this energy is, they're angry. Okay, because you close out a cycle and they don't want you to close out a cycle with them because they're possibly poverty stricken, just getting out of jail, starting back up on their feet. And they don't know which way they need to go in there and remorse because they fucked up and kept you in an illusion and you ended up cutting their ass out, Gemini. And you might communicate that to them too is why they're going to be ended up in depression if they show up anywhere. Okay. What else, Holy Spirit? Tell me what the, um, what is the Five of Pentacles, please? Bad luck. Karma. Boom. Whatever they invested in. The judgment got called on immediately because they were being manipulative, okay? So that's why they're angry because you close out a cycle to the manipulation, to the lies. They possibly was having concubines, having sex with everybody, having three, three different other lovers or options. They made you an option when you were the choice the whole entire time. They were on. They were taking. They were take. They were slow to give you an offer. They were slow to give you a commitment, okay? And this is why they rejected your offer, because they were out playing around, you know, with their options in an illusion, confusion, being quick, wanting to be seen, no structure, no discipline, but they needed structure and discipline in order to move forward. So they tried to get, they try to keep you in an illusion that they did have structure and discipline, but they never did. That's why they slowed this whole relationship down and would leave you out in the cold. And because they left you out in the cold, God said, no more. I'm going to close out the cycle, bitch. And now Gemini is moving forward while the will has turned in your and not has turned in the favor of the person that's on your mind into the five of pentacles. Okay. And what else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, they invested in a whole nother family situation, which ended up leaving them out in the cold. Whatever they invested in, like I said, it keeps repeating. They were manipulate because there have been manipulation in their lies, even though the seven of swords is not here. You know, the magician is manipulation, and you have the wheel of fortune and the five of pentacles. That's karma on their money, karma on every damn thing. The cycle's completed. They don't want it to end, so that's why they want to come and reconcile with you. Okay, and they're spying on you to see... Do you have options? Do you have options? But you got this person blocked from seeing any damn thing. And this, this makes them sad too. So they want to reach out and communicate to you that they want to reinvest. And, but you got it. I said, you got them blocked. You got out of Dodge. You moved the hell away. Okay. If you have a family with this person, you got your kids, you got yourself, you got your everybody and you, you, you took off babies. You, you took off. You move to calmer waters and you're blocking this person from coming towards you as well. They're trying to move to calmer waters towards you. They're trying to figure out how they can come together and keep you in an illusion. But you're blocking them from even coming towards you or spirits blocking them because God does the world card. But that's in reverse because they don't want it to end with you. What else, Holy Spirit? Yeah, they want a family. They want a family. They're trying to get to calmer waters to this Ten of Pentacles, uh, and they're sad about it because you done laid the whole relationship to rest. Yep, you did. You're done with this. They could, You could be resting, relaxing, and rejuvenating. I see you out by the pool in the backyard, you know, swimming, relaxing, enjoying the sun. Could have a family reunion, getting together with family and friends, your dogs and stuff, animals, kids, cousins, mm -hmm. enjoying life. And like I said, y'all about to go travel across the seas, over water, at the beach, at some beautiful resort. There is like a park-looking beach. Or I want to say island. There's an island that looks like a park. I don't know why. Spirit's just saying it looks like a park. And it's an island. Wow. Okay. But you guys are traveling for sure. Some of y'all live by a ravine. I don't know why I'm picking up L.A., but I see L.A., Okay, the L.A. River, somebody's standing in the L.A. River, or somebody's river, or near a river, Jordan's River, somebody's river, reminiscing and thinking about you, Gemini, how they done fucked up, and yeah, and they need your assistance, because some of them want to reach out to, to you to tell you that they are ill, 
They are. They looking at you as a counterpart, y'all. They are so attracted to you because the Queen of Pentacles wanted to pop out. Then we got the King of Pentacles right here. So this King of Pentacles is stuck and waiting for his ships to come in. Or they're waiting for forward movement. They're waiting for the next investments. I don't know. Maybe that's why they want to come towards you too. Because their money is not moving right. While you're at the Ten of Cups. Okay. Ten of Pentacles. Ten of Cups. Energy. They are at the uh, Knight of Pentacles. Five of Pentacles. And the Wheel of Fortune. Energy. Yeah. They're not doing very well. So they could literally be sick. Or they, things are just moving slow in their life for them. Yeah, God set their ass down because of whatever they invested in. What is this person investing? Why God set them down, Spirit? Why did God set them down? Because they're supposed to be healing. They were supposed to give you an offer and putting teamwork and collaboration with you, Gemini. They were supposed to be working with you. They didn't want to work with you. They they were supposed to be healing. You were sent to heal this person. You were sent to go. You guys are supposed to be some type of religious leader, spiritual team together, something. Stars in the spotlight somewhere. I don't know. Okay? You guys are supposed to be healing each other in the spotlight, married, higher level of commitment. This person now wants to come back and ask for forgiveness and heal things. Okay? Because they know... They, that's why God said, so they sitting down reminiscing and reflecting on how they supposed to, they got the downloads, but they ignored spirit, honey. They did. So now they have emotions for you and they want to come and offer you some love and try to re, uh, try to reverse this 10 of swords. Okay. Because they understand they have some type of enlightenment. They see now what they were supposed to do, who you are to them. Okay. So yeah. They see how they broke your heart. Like you were the one. It's been illuminated. And they want to come back and make some type of apology. Because you because you were the love of their life. Honestly. Like they have nostalgic memories and feelings about you. They're very addicted to you. And they're also controlling. Okay. This is a very controlling person. What else Holy Spirit? What's the um. Oh yeah. So when they left you out in the sun. I mean they left you out in the sun probably did if you was at the beach i don't know for some of y'all but they're realizing and they see right now they know they're going through karma because they did leave you out in the cold and they slowed this whole situation down and they possibly offered this cup which is a fish cup that didn't go nowhere now they want to reconcile with you because shit ended with whatever situation that they offered that fish cup to it was fishy mm, someone right mm, and yeah what else, spirit? Yeah. Ooh, and that's why they ghosted you. And you know why that's why they ghosted you. Because they offered their cup to someone from their past. Someone whom they had history with, possibly. That's why they slowed this relationship down, left you out. And God slowed their ass down. And now, because they're moving so slow, and I don't know if they can recoup, because the Four of Swords is like, I can't move. Like, I'm re resting, rejuvenating, recouping something now they want to come back because you're in the queen of pentacles energy but when you left them they, what energy are they in right now and what is this king of pentacles who is the king of pentacles like why are they coming back now like why like uh, why secrets something you possibly don't know maybe some you don't know somebody walked away from them somebody ghosted them so how they did how they did you is how someone did them this king of pentacles what else, Spirit? Why does the King of Pentacles want to come back? What else are the secret? What is the secret? Do they have another family? There's a secret that they, that they possibly still married or got a baby mama. Yeah, they met, they're in a relationship and they're not going to tell you. They're going to try to make you a concubine. Uh-huh, third party in a sense. They're going to try to offer you money to invest to be a third party. I don't feel you're going to go for that. That's not your energy signature. What else, Spirit? Yeah, you don't play that shit. Yeah, they're going to offer you money to invest, and you're going to have to make a judgment call. Yeah, you're going to make a judgment call, Gemini. You're going to have to make a judgment call if you want to work on this relationship with they ass. Take a leap of faith and shit. It might cause a little bit of anxiety and stress you out a little bit, but you're going to have to remain strong, honey. Okay? You're going to have to remain strong. Yes, because it is going to be a three. It's going to be a sister wife or sister or, or brother husband's relationship. And spirits say that's the truth. 
that is the truth if you take this offer because they might offer you a lump sum something i don't know mm, spirit Ooh, you're gonna get breadcrumb Ooh, this is a devil the devil gonna breadcrumb you and then you're gonna be imbalanced in this relationship so if you take this offer from this king of pentacles this 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 whack-ass offer which is a toxic offer this king of pentacles does it they're addicted to money number one or they think you addicted to money. They think you're a bird bitch and they're still going to be given to two. Okay? Even though they're going to be telling you that they want to equal give and take. And this whole transaction that's going to go down, if it should go down. Now this will go down in the lower vibrational frequencies of the collective. But on the high vibrational frequencies, definitely you already on game. So you're not, you're not even, this is not your energy. I'm not picking up my high vibrational energies. Accepting this um, energy because spirit's telling me in the same breath that if whoever the lower vibrational frequencies that accept this energy and do what the hell you want to do but know that every choice has a consequence and you don't get to choose the consequences is because how you live your life is dictated how you move the energy in the spirit and if you move the energy in the spirit towards this energy you're going to be in balance in your finances, in your emotions, in everything. You're going to think you're going to get an equal give and take. Look who's offering it to you, this earth sign. So it's a Capricorn possibly, or, or it's either an earth sign offering in a devilistic energy. Spirit said that is the truth. They want to get you knocked up, have a baby to hold on to you, and you're going to end up heartbroken. Why the fuck did you take? Because you're going to feel left out in the cold and say, why the hell did you take this third party situation? Yep, and that's the truth. Gemini, that's you. That's going to be your imbalancing or whoever in the lower vibrational Gemini energy. Yeah, if you take this third party reconciliation. All it's going to do is the Queen of Wands, they gonna, this is how they're going to look at you. It's the Queen of Wands energy. Not that the Queen of Wands is a little hoe, but that's how they're going to look at you. Because they're offering you up to be in a third party situation. No, fuck that. You don't get breadcrumbs. You the motherfucking... You the motherfucking one, Gemini. You're the the empress. I was gonna say the empress, and she wanted to come out. I know she wanted to come out so hard. Look at her. She wanted to come out so hard. Okay. You not an option. You the choice. Okay. You're the world. This person, yeah. So they want to come in and possibly knock you up and keep you trapped. Like I said before, with this sun card, it's gonna break your heart. But that's gonna be karma. And it's still not gonna like it's still gonna be like not you're not gonna have a solid family situation because they're still gonna be back and forth and in and out in this flighty ass energy. Yeah. And you're gonna be feeling defeated while this is all they wanted to do is one up ya. Mm-hmm. Yep, yep, yep. One up ya and get you into this raggedy ass open marriage. You see, it's open, open relationship. That's gonna cause all this con shit. Lord have mercy. You see how I hit the floor? It's going to cause all this conflict and chaos because they're going to keep you in a competition, always fighting for this two of cups with the per with this person. So don't get finagled by the damn devil, Gemini. Do not get finagled by the damn devil. All they want to do is just hold on to your ass. Baby, hold on to me. So yeah, they want to hold on to you. This person is greedy and selfish, very manipulative, and they're always at work. So you're never going to really be able to spend time with them. And they're going to lie about when they have... Yeah, this person is going to be lying. When they tell you that they have to work, they're going to be going between a whole nother lover. They really are. And they're, they're... Child, I promise you. They're going to be going to a whole nother lover when they tell you that they have to go to work. And they're lying to you. They're going down because this is... They're, look, they're going to the open marriage. Okay? This is the path that they're, you're, going, you're going down if you take this relationship. Um, so what else? Spirit, tell us more. What is in this person's um? We already got all of that. So what's the outcome? Well, the outcome is like toxic. If yeah, it's gonna be they're gonna cheat on you if you go get back with them. Oh my gosh. So this is for newer energies that came in, family. So don't panic. I already know you're not going back. This is not your energy. You're in the Empress energy, and the Empress don't. The Empress, mm -mm, she didn't learn her lesson. You're psychic, so you already know what the fuck's going down. You in the good wheel of fortune, and this is breaking this person's heart. And they don't want the cycle to be over, so they want to come and stop you, stop your flow. They want to block you from success. So you got choices to make. You got options. You got choices. Remember, you're not the option. You are the choice. 
okay? And just know this person just wants to come in and slow you down because they're slow, okay? So I'm going to end your reading right there, Gemini. We're going to do another one, and I hope this has helped you. Till next time, bye.